Hello everyone. Let's try to solve this question from the chapter Light, Reflection and Refraction. Let's go through the question and try to understand what is given in the question. A ray of light incident on a rectangular glass slab immersed in any medium emerges parallel to itself. Draw label diagram to justify the statement so here what is given to us is that a ray of light is incidented on a rectangular glass slab and this glass slab is immersed in any medium so what is found that this ray of light it emerges parallel to itself when it leaves the glass slab so let's draw the diagram so first of all we'll be drawing a rectangular glass slab okay let's say that this is our rectangular glass slab let's say here we have a normal and at this normal we have got an incident light okay this incident light now gets refracted when it enters in the medium that is the glass lab so now we will draw it in this way showing that it moves towards the normal now at this surface again let's draw a normal now when this ray leaves since it emerges from a denser medium to a rare medium the ray merging will be away from the i mean thus normal so let's say that this normal line basically is somewhat like this okay now we have to show that the emerging ray will also be parallel to this ray so what will say that this is our incident light let's say this point is E and this point is F and let's say that it makes an angle I from the normal that is N and dash and let's say it has it makes an angle of reflection that is R1 now considering the second normal line that is this let's say this is m m dash okay this was our incident line now this is our refracted line now again when this is refracted at this interface now this becomes our final refracted line and so this one is nothing but our second incident angle let it be i2 and let this one be i1 and this is our again the second refracted angle that is r2 so and let this straight line be the extension of the incident line so what we see that both these lines are parallel 
let's say here is our medium and this is our glass now again this is our medium so we can say that this is our glass lab let it be a b c and d and let our emerging ray be g h and well we can say that let's this point be o and let this point be o dash so what we find that the incident ray which is on this interface of medium and glass since it enters from a rarer to a denser our refracted ray is now moving towards the normal now when this refracted ray again gets refracted from this glass to medium that is from the denser medium to the rare medium it again moves away from the normal and finally what we find is that this both lines are parallel to each other so here EF is our incident ray and GH can be our final emerging ray or the emergent ray which is parallel to EF.